Elon Musk has been vocal about his plans for a manufacturing plant in India, but with one stringent condition, only if import duties are lowered. He has argued that this sort of concession would help establish the brand and build demand before they could scale up on local manufacturing. But the plot took an interesting turn last month when the Indian government introduced a new EV policy that lowers the import taxes to as low as 15% on some models, given that a manufacturer invests at least $500 million and also sets up its factory in the country. I never say no to Elon Musk. I tell him that you are welcome in India. But if only if you want to manufacture in China and only you want to sell in India, then you will not get the concessions. If you come to India, you start manufacturing here, sell the car, you are welcome, we are waiting for you. Reports suggest Musk is also evaluating the possibility of setting up a joint venture with Reliance Industries. The latest developments come days after U.S. Secretary of Treasury Janet Yellen concluded a four-day-long visit to China, warning Beijing to scale back its EV production to avoid flooding the market. And when the global market is flooded by artificially cheap Chinese products, the viability of American and other foreign firms is put into question. And we've seen this story before. Over a decade ago, massive PRC government support led to below-cost Chinese steel that flooded the global market and decimated industries across the world and in the United States. I've made clear that President Biden and I will not accept that reality again. Musk is likely to make an India investment of nearly $3 billion that could go up to $10 billion as the company grows in the world's third largest automotive market. Hinting towards the entry of Tesla in India, Musk recently tweeted, India should have electric cars like every other country has electric cars. It's a natural progression to provide Tesla electric vehicles in India. The explosive growth story of India's tech and auto sectors makes it one of the most attractive and lucrative markets for EV manufacturers. But does that mean Teslas are about to take off on Indian roads? Will Elon finally set up a factory in India? What does this mean for existing players like Tata, MG and Mahindra? Well, we can only hope that we have definitive answers to all these questions come April 22nd. Pinch yourself, this isn't a dream. The Tesla Model 3 is here with us on Indian roads. The big question that we keep asking, even at Business Today, is this a tech company? Is this an automotive company? Is it a tech company that just builds cars? Is it Elon Musk's passion project? Well, it is one of the coolest car brands out there, the most coveted, the most sought after, and we have the Tesla Model 3 here on India Today. Yeah, don't miss the alloys on this one. And of course, Tesla has this uncanny knack of picking colors like this one. You can spot the cameras as well, eight of them around the car. I'll get inside and show you the dynamic range on those cameras. That is when you know this is a technology company. When you have so many smartphone manufacturers putting millions of dollars into really acing their smartphone camera game, you have to see the, the rear camera and the side cameras on this. In fact, that's what makes the autopilot sensors really work. And, and, and that's an interesting technology play. This is also one of my favorite parts of the car. If you want to unlock it, this lovely, classy, this is not my visiting card, the Tesla card, tap it right here on this sensor. And when you see, well, the rear view mirror is turning, the car has unlocked for you. You're already worried about the rising fuel prices, then you don't need to pull any lever inside. All you have to do is come at the back, give this a nice tap, and that reveals the charging ports. Traditionally, you'd have a trunk at the back, but since this is an EV, you're not gonna be cribbing about storage space anytime soon. Time 
to take you guys inside. This is what makes the car truly special. Put my foot on the brake, enter my personal code for my profile. There you go. It feels like a sci-fi movie, honestly. And I want to show you guys what the entire interior is like. It's clean, it's subtle, it's smooth, it's classy. Well, you, of course, you have this fantastic sporty steering wheel. There's no, you know, display over here with your, with your cluster and then a smaller screen out here. It's just one neat tablet. The ground clearance here on this car, right about here, we've had some issues while we were taking it out for a spin. Well, essentially, on a lot of the bumps and a lot of the speed breakers, this wasn't necessarily the car you would want on those particular roads. But, well, we managed. We slalom through it on different angles. Mm -hmm. 